Here we go, here we go, here we go! What are some of the tricks again? Google, how can I open up a jar? Ooh. Tap the lid with a spoon. To read more, tap the lid with a spoon. You guys, there's a blue jay in our backyard. Oh, just missed him. Oh, there he is again. Oh, he's so beautiful. Yeah, princess blue jay. <laughs> I don't know. Actually, I don't know if it's a boy or girl. Your pumpkin art? Are they smiling? No, no, no I'll show you what it is. What are they doing? I'll show you what it is. Oh, yeah, that looks accurate. Remember, I showed you how to turn it into a smile? Done! <gasps> Look at those happy smiles! Miyako! <laughs> Okay, after that you gotta brush your teeth. I have to put your hair up at school. I could do braids again, you want braids? Braids, just one right here and one Okay, I know how to do that, let's do it. I want you to make one button up here and then two braids. Up in the middle and then two braids down here. That's gonna be very interesting. That's what you want? You want two buns? You want two buns? Only one bun. One bun. Okay. Salt Lake City, baby. Third tour stop of YouTube Secrets book tour on a Provo. One of the best tacos I've ever had. Taco Shop San Marcos. Taco Shop San Marcos. Legit. If you ever get lost, just look for this mountain right here. That's like right next to it. Juliana and I are flying out tomorrow and we have our annual parent panel meeting with YouTube kids and it falls on her birthday. So I was like, I don't think I'm gonna go because I don't want to be without Juliana on her birthday. Then I decided, why don't we just bring her? So Juliana and I are flying out in the morning. Benji's just gonna meet us there because he's in Utah right now and rather than him coming back to Seattle then flying out again, it just makes sense that he'll do a straight flight. I'm really looking forward to it. I'm excited to go to San Francisco. It's been a while since I've been there. I did a, a what is it, a questionnaire, a poll, and I asked how many of the people that follow me on Instagram who are parents have the YouTube Kids app and only 50% said they had. A lot of people said because they didn't know that there was a YouTube Kids app, that or they deleted it because of the inappropriate content. Oh my gosh, with the whole thing that happened earlier this year with adults dressed in costumes doing so many inappropriate things. I don't know why. Parents just didn't want to take the risk and they deleted it. So since then, they had a huge crackdown on all those kind of videos. I personally have not experienced anything inappropriate. I think the only thing, sometimes Juliana would be watching some videos that you can tell is targeted towards older kids, like 11 year olds. So I automatically block those channels and I think that was all I noticed. It's completely free. It gets rid of all those scary ads. And if you have YouTube Premium, you could connect it so you get no ads at all. I don't get paid at all. I don't earn a commission from anybody downloading the app. I just genuinely love the app and my kids use it all the time whenever I let them use the iPad. Oh, if you guys have any suggestions or concerns or questions, comment them down below. Cause that's kind of the whole reason why we're on the panel. We wanna relay whatever comments or concerns you guys have and make the app better and safe for the kids. Okay, which pajamas are we bringing on the trip? We're just gonna be gone for two nights, so I'm just gonna bring one set of pajamas. Let's do her frozen gown. That'll be good. Shauna, we're we gonna get through all these. What do you think? <laughs> About to start, you guys. Probo Utah. These 
guys have some kind of Diablo pepper. I'm a little intimidated. On our secret menu, uh -huh. Diablo style cayenne cinnamon sugar. Wow. Inferno style is okay. habanero cinnamon sugar. Okay. okay. This is the first night we're ever doing it. This is La Muerte, oh my God. which means death in Spanish. Death. This is ghost pepper cinnamon sugar. Correct. So, um, okay. I can't, I mean, I still have to talk to people. We well, do actually have a waiver if you'd like to sign it. No, no, I, okay. I don't soak it. This is gnarly, you okay. guys. Are you gonna overreact? Yeah. Not gonna overreact, but I'm not gonna really bite into this. You know what you like inside? <laughs> We've got Nutella. You had to say the leche. Sweet cream is also a what good choice. What would people go good with this? Go sweet, pepper. sweet cream or Nutella. Oh, yeah. Chocolate pairs well with spice. Yeah, let's do the okay. Nutella. This is the really I'm not gonna. Like, I'm not gonna take a, like a full on bite. I think maybe. Yeah, let's you do too. it. I mean, you need to take uh, a full like, on bite. Right. Right. Yeah, there you go. Woo. It's is, is spicy. Yep. I'm filling in my tongue, <laughs> filling it on my uh, forehead. Do another bite, just for the, for the haters. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> See, that time there was no Nutella. <laughs> I never had ghost pepper. Like, it's starting to hit me. <laughs> so, typically, I'd put the kids' clothes in plastic bags, the block bags, just to keep it organized. But since we're just going for two nights, I'm not even going to worry about that. And plus, I just have one kid with me. So this is gonna be pretty easy breezy. I feel like this luggage is a little a little extra for how long we're gonna be gone, but I didn't wanna go on the ladder and get the smaller ones. And Benji has the one that I really like, so. is it the only thing I need to pack is my um, makeup and I'll do that tomorrow morning here's all the party stuff the twins are so sweet they helped me put together Juliana's goodie bags for all of her friends and family it's not a Travis party if we don't have the little pin the tail on the donkey toy except this one is pin the unicorn horn on the unicorn filled up their pinata this one is supposed to be one of those pinatas that you hit but auntie mel is genius she added these strings to the bottom of the unicorn so um, most of them are just like hot glue but one of them is connected to the little flap that will open and hopefully all the candy spills out. So we'll see how this goes. I think 98% of the time with these kind of pinatas, the flap doesn't open, but since we kind of DIY'd it, hopefully it'll work. So I'll have all this leftover candy, but this will be for Halloween. And this is what I got Juliana for her birthday. I found this on Amazon and they're little like, they're not American girl, brand but it's called dolly and me sweater dress for her and then a sweater dress for julie they came with pants as well a pajama set isn't that cute then it comes with a nighty inside got those two outfits and, and these lps toys actually mia the other day found this in my makeup room because i tried to hide it and she's like mommy what is this and then obviously juliana saw and then i told her it was for her birthday so she can't have it until our birthday but every now and then i see juliana sneaking in and just like looking at the box so she's really excited to open this that's what i got for jb's birthday you guys want to see something cool dun, 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 dun. please don't tell me i'm the only one that reuses gift bags i save all the gift bags that my kids get and look look how useful it is oh and i save the tissue so easy and i didn't have to spend a penny i've been trying to open up this jar of sauce <clears throat> like 10 minutes now. Wait, this should do it, right? Ow! Woo! Getting worried because I don't want the meat to go dry. Here we go, here we go, here we go! Go, 
Google, how can I open up a jar? One, brute force. Two, wrap the lid in a dish towel or rubber glove. Three, break the vacuum seal. Four, run the lid under hot water. And five, Ooh. tap the lid with a spoon. To read more, tap the, the lid with a your spoon. Google map. Juliana's going with a bachan to the American Girl doll store. This is unbelievable how difficult this is. I don't have a rubber glove. Oh wait, here, I do, I do. It has like the rubber, rubber grips. For American Girl? Yeah, Jackie looks like the glove worked. It actually popped open. Just put in all the sauce. At the JB is leaving. She's going on her birthday date with Obachan. Hey, have fun. Lobo. Oh, you guys, we have a little friend. School. You're playing school? Uh -huh. Where's your student? Now that the Juliana is out, we're gonna go out. I need to get, um, oh, I have a list somewhere. Where to put my list? I'm just gonna get some last minute things for the party. I also need to get um, whipped cream because every birthday, every birthday morning, I have to do the birthday pancakes. What? They now have grass fed whole organic milk. That's new. Uh, we don't need that. <laughs> we don't need cheese balls. Whipped cream. Oh, there's not a lot of options. Uh, excuse me. Okay, next stop, gift wrapping paper. Oh, don't bump into the beer. Oh, that's a good one. I like the glitter. Good choice, ladies. This is my favorite. We're gonna get this too. All the Halloween stuff is out. Should we get this? Yeah. No, we're not gonna get this. You wanna see the scary stuff? Did you want to see it? No! You guys need to agree on one toy for at the JB. I know mommy, I know you. Mm-hmm. I know, I know those. Oh, how about this? No. This is like the original Polly Pocket. Yeah, it's tiny. No. I don't know. Disney getting in on their little mini figurines. Kira, do you think she'll like it? Yeah. Do you think she'll like this? There's lots of surprises inside. Kira really wants to get one. Toy. So that one. No. No, it's at the JB's birthday. It's not a time for you to get a toy. Yeah. Do you want to see the Yeah, she's been talking about it. What do you think about this one? Yeah, that one. Hey, yeah. how about unicorn one? Yeah. Oh, you're so right. Not Remember? But she likes unicorns. So this is what the girls ended up picking up for Juliana. It's a fingerling toy. Juliana's been talking about this last couple of years. So that's what, oh yeah, and a, I don't know, a fingerling mini. Our washer was acting up a couple weeks ago. It was um, like after each load, it would be drenched. So we got it checked and the guy said that the Tide Pods weren't really good for our washer. So I figure rather than using the pods, we'll just switch to the liquid detergent. I love the downy infusion scent, especially this Amber Blossom because we use the fabric sheets. This is the first time I'm using the detergent so our clothes are really gonna smell amazing. Just ran out of Q-tips. The kids are gonna decorate their pumpkins with these cool craft stuff. Oh, we're going to do these cool crafts that I saw. I think it was Good Morning America on how to make spooky little bat eyes using toilet paper rolls. And last but not least, Juliana has been drawing a lot and I'm asking her to keep her artwork and I can't fit it all in the fridge. So I thought we would start an art folder for her. I think she'll really enjoy this. And that's it. Oh, and the girls got chips. You want to show your chips? Yeah. Doritos.
So what did you get? That's cute. I think it's just cartoony. Okay. <laughs> or this. Wow. And then I got a beautiful. Oh, and then a bed for your Julie stock? No, yeah, Julie's dog. Thank you, Obashan. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. But no crying aloud. You don't cry over this. Mommy? Yes. Say anything as your last day as a five year old? Thank you. <laughs> We're gonna call it a night and we will see you bright and early tomorrow morning. Bye, night. <laughs>